All right, welcome everybody to, uh, I think this is week five of the PML Draft League. Um, going up against a very formidable opponent today, the Augusta Agrons. Um, it's also 4th of July, so hopefully the uh, freedom of the day frees me from my losing streak. Uh, I'm not going to count on that. Um, he is undefeated going into this battle, so... Uh, at the very least, it's going to be really rough. Um, so we will just have to see uh, how we do um, using some new mons uh, this week. So um, I'm anxious to try them out. Uh, we do have Alolan Sandslash and Vicavolt that are both newer. Um, really interested to do that. I watched his previous battles. Um, He's very good. Um, he's not too predictable, <laughs> uh, so it's going to make this even harder. Um, not to mention his Sigilif alone has eight kills, so uh, going to be rough. Um, so I'm anticipating him uh, leading with Rotom Mo. Uh, it's the one he favors, so I'm actually going to lead if if that happens if he brings Rotamo, I'm going to lead Arcanine uh, in an attempt to bait a Volt switch and then first turn I'm going to go ahead and just switch uh, straight to Crocodile um, giving me potentially a free attack assuming he's choice scarfed as he usually is. Um, so yeah I guess we'll just see how that goes. Um, from there I'm going to try to do as much damage with uh, Crocodile as I can. Um, He's got Mammoth Swine that he hasn't brought to anything yet. I'm anticipating him bringing that uh, now, um, as I do have a, a large weakness to both rock and ground, so it can do... Yep, he, and he did bring it. Uh, brought a couple I, I wasn't prepared for. Um, I thought he might bring Gudra. I didn't prep too much for Crawdont. Um, he didn't bring... That's interesting. He didn't bring his Rotom Mo, so... Um, that throws that strategy out the window. Uh, looks like lots of rock ground. Um, curious what he has to outspeed me. I think what we'll do is we'll just go ahead and start with the Crocodile. See what he starts with. Um, if we have to switch, we have to switch. Uh, so be it. Uh, Vicavolt would not be a terrible one to start with, um, but I did leave my uh, my traps behind, my um, sticky web and stealth rocks and all that. I decided not to bring those this time, so uh, we'll see here. Uh, either way, uh, despite the fact that we're uh, losing all of our battles, we are having fun. Um, I like to use these leagues as an opportunity to try out new mons. Uh, so let's see. Okay, so he leads there. He's... It's hard to say if he's going to outspeed me or not. That was, that was good, uh, Oblivious. Um, I don't have anything that's particularly good against it. Um, he could go with an Ice-type move to, to deal damage to me. Um, he might be trying to bait a switch. Um... I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna we're gonna hope for the best. We're gonna go for a beat up and uh, go from there. He might be choice scarfed, in which case he's gonna wreck me. Okay, so we do get a free um, attack here, uh, which is great. Uses up his item, so I can't knock him off later. Um, let's see how much damage we can really do on this guy here. I mean, we're, we're at half HP, even after the berry. A uh, couple crits in there. Uh, pretty good stuff. 
Uh, he might have to switch it out and, and regenerate it. Um, I'm going to go for the beat-up again. I, I see no reason not to. Uh, if we can kill this early, that'd be great. He he depends on uh, Slowbo pretty heavily to switch out and switch in, get his, um, uh, his trick room up if he needs it, uh, which he honestly hasn't really. Um, so I guess we'll see what he decides to do here. Uh, apologies if you can hear fireworks outside. Um, some of them sound like they're being set off right next to my house, so you might see me jump. Alright, switching out. Um, I'm hoping this thing doesn't have a uh, rocky helmet. <laughs> that would be a bummer. That would hurt a lot. Okay, we're good. So he's getting that up, just to have the defenses, I assume. Maybe he's trying to bait me into an earthquake. Um, let's actually, let's look what he, he could possibly switch to. Um, uh, let's see. I mean, not, not too much. I'm curious what he going to do. Maybe he's going to explode. Um, get a kill. That's good. Uh, he's got sand up, which of course doesn't affect me. Um, maybe he's... does he have anything that can increase his power, his speed with sand? Sand brush. Um, that's big. So let's go ahead and switch out here. I don't have much for him. I'm worried about switching a Halucha in and, and getting out sped right away. Um, Oh, that's tough. That's a tough switch. Let's go with, let's see, his Excadrill. He might have it Life Orb, Earthquake, Aerial Ace, Rock Slide, Shadow Cloth, all things he's brought before. Let's go with Mantine and uh, see if we can just absorb a hit, hopefully. Um, we can possibly wait out some of the sand, uh, depending on how hard he hits me if he uses a rock move. Okay, so he's going bigger, going home, right? Uh, might as well. Max Quake does nothing. He'll undoubtedly go for a rock move here. Um, I don't really have anything that's just going to eat a straight up move from him. Um, he's going to outspeed me. We're going to hope that I can maybe just survive it and roost. Um, let's actually, let's try to get a tailwind up so whatever I send out has a chance of outspeeding him. Probably gonna regret that. Probably should have went with Roost because of the rock fall, but uh, oof, didn't matter. Okay. <laughs> so what? That's gonna give him some special defense, I think. Okay, so he's life orbed. Um, here. Go for the Arcanine. Get some Intimidate. 
least lower his attack. Um, and then if we have to sack him on, we can sack him on. Uh, we'll just send out Vickavolt to honestly probably try to eat up a, a turn of his. Uh, hit the last turn of his Dynamax. This is rough. Um, <laughs> Not gonna lie, never want to just sack mons. Uh, typically, a Mantine can eat an attack or two, um, and that's even my my bulkier Mantine. So, uh, just that's you know, super effectiveness coming through. Uh, he might not be Sand Rush. He might be. Um, yeah, that's a good call. That's the wrong move. Um, oh, I am so surprised that I survived that. <laughs> Ooh, 4 HP. Um, he, he, I don't know what he's gonna do, genuinely. Honestly, at this point, I think I just... I lose the Vickable. I don't want to switch in and lose something else. Um, okay, so he's got Iron Head. We always got uh, probably Rock Slide. Don't know if I'm gonna outspeed him or not. <sighs> He's hitting hard. Maybe have to sand force. Um, ooh, the fighting move hurts. Uh, not as bad as I thought, uh, so that's good. He'll lose a little HP. He does outspeed me, so we've learned that at least. <laughs> uh, we take down his howitzer, which is nice. He's got plenty in the back to, to bring out and just continue wrecking, so uh, we'll see if we can slow that down, hopefully stop it. undoubtedly going to you know try to set something up um, I have only the four mons now so the beat ups not gonna deal near as much damage um, also only a 40% chance to flinch um, so odds are he's gonna hit me with probably like a scald or something and take me out That's really nice. Sandstorm's down. Um, and again, he's going to have to switch out here or uh, get seriously hurt. Okay, so we've got Gudra. Um, I genuinely don't know. Let's see, what, what's Gudra's speed? 80? So, we don't know if he's choice scarfed anything yet. This thing could just blow past me. Um, I've only got half HP left. We're gonna we're gonna see if we can just deal some damage. Get the knock off. That's fine. Uh, took off the assault vest. That's really nice. Uh, Surf. So we've got a special attacking Gudra here. It can be run either way. 
we lose Crocodile. Um, got a special attacking Gudra. Could have a fire move and just straight up on me. Uh, if I Dynamax a lot speed. It's tough. Um, I'm gonna outspeed him here. We can see if we can survive a hit from him. Close combat. We get the kill. That's great. Um, we're going to use the white herb. It's going to trigger the unburden. It's also going to uh, increase the strength of my um, acrobatics. He doesn't have any flying weaknesses, but that's still going to make Halucha hit pretty hard. I'm always worried about uh, being able to trigger that on Halucha. He, uh, he can't take much of a hit, so um, you have to plan it well, or it has to align really well. Okay, so he's going to have an Ice-type move here. Um, I think what we're going to do... We're just going to really hope that he doesn't destroy me with one move. We're going to go for the Max Knuckle. Um, try to get the stab. Uh, already really fast. I don't think he can outspeed me unless he's got a Choice Scarf on, uh, which he's brought one to every single battle, so um, odds are someone is holding the, the Choice Scarf. I think I outsped this Mammoth Swine before. No, it would have had damage. Nice shard. I mean, that hurts a lot. Uh, it definitely hurts a lot. And there's nothing I can do about her prio move, so... Ooh, fortunately for me, I was able to take it out in the one hit. Critical hit. Very nice. Very lucky. Um, I'll take it. Take all the luck I can get. I genuinely don't remember what he has left. Uh, I know he's got a Slowbro. Um, he brought. Let's see, oh, he's got a Crawdont. Um, Slowbro can eat up some attacks. Maybe, you know, try to spend the rest of my my Dynamax trying to take out his Slowbro. Um, otherwise, he's got to go with the Crawdont. Uh, looks like. Looks like Cardon's pretty slow. Even if it's Choice Scarfed, I'm gonna outspeed. Okay, so going with the Slowbro. I mean, that's smart. Try to eat up uh, some of my moves here. Um, let's go for the Max Darkness. Get as much damage as we can in. Maybe we'll, you know, if we live a turn, we'll try to finish with uh, the Max Airstream just to increase our speed. Um, oh, yeah, I mean, you gotta switch it out, man, right? Psychic, nice. It's probably... Oh, I cannot believe I lived that. Um, I don't know. I doubt Slowbro has a prior move. Um, honestly, he might switch out. Um, so we're going to go with a fighting type move. Just in case. Now, Crawdont probably has Aqua Jet. Uh... <laughs> So he's just gonna like, boom, kill me, right? Um, is that his last mod? Sure wish I still had Mantine. It is his last mod. Um, honestly... I don't have 
much that can kill it. He, his Aqua Jet's definitely gonna. Uh, so I might as well lose the Halucha instead of. Let's go for Taunt, uh, just in case he's gonna try to. You know, yeah, okay. Cool, 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 cool. We've got two Mons, he's got one. Both of mine are at full HP, but nothing particularly good against him, right? And we've spent our... Well, um, we can go for the Scorching Sands to try to get a burn um, after I use a burn up because I want to get rid of that weakness. Um, he's probably got a fighting move to just destroy me here. Um, so let's go with Arcanine first. Um, hopefully get that uh, Intimidate. Let's do the burn up just to get rid of the weakness. Hopefully I can survive long enough to, to make that worth it. <laughs> Uh, at the very least, this has been a really fun battle. Um, he's, as I've mentioned, undefeated going into this, so um, even getting this far um, with him being on the last Mon, I feel very lucky. Um, even if I end up losing this battle, uh, it's been really, really cool. Um, so that's, you know, at least that. Um, got two minutes left. Going for the Swords Dance. Uh, the Aqua Jet, I assume, to try to kill. Um, should have brought extreme speed. I should have brought extreme speed. So now he'll go for Aqua Jet. It might kill. It doesn't. Um, we get the Scorching Sands. And that's game. Uh, that's awesome. Uh, he's probably... Um, hopefully he enjoyed the battle, but probably not too happy about... Uh, ending his losing streak. It's not going to matter. He's going to make it to playoffs. He's been doing great. So a uh, great job throughout the whole thing, Ryan. Um, it's been a really, really fun battle. Um, and uh, have a good evening. All right. Bye, everyone.